ladies and most of you gentlemen today we're going to take a look at the night fake confident back attachments but before we get into all of that i just want to thank the sponsor of this video and that is my twitch channel twitch.tv slash mr gm if you want to check me out streaming in shadowlands alpha i'll be over on twitch.tv slash mr gm right so at blizzcon they announced that all four of the covenants will get these kind of back attachments similar to what we saw with like the rathian backpack in 8.3 or some of the heritage armors and they call it something like cloaks 2.0 and the Shadowlands Alpha data is out and we can finally take our first look at some of these attachments. There are three tiers for each Covenant, so we're going to check out all three tiers for the Night Fae Covenant in this video. So yeah, let's just jump straight in with the Tier 1 Night Fae Back Attachment. Okay, so we aren't actually sure whether or not it's going to be kind of like an upgrade system or you just get to choose one of the three in the game files are just listed as one, two, three. So we don't really know. Uh, Wowhead lists them as tier one, two and three. So again, not too sure. We haven't actually seen the system implemented on the alpha as of yet, but this is the tier one. It is essentially some swirly sticks that are glowing. Now from the back, it kind of looks a bit rubbish, but when you turn it round to the front, I can see some appeal it's kind of like wooden wings it would look quite nice on something like a druid especially like a cult druid which is kind of drusty but uh yeah essentially it's just some swirly glowy sticks it actually looks pretty cool luckily because it's quite flat it doesn't clip with the armor which is nice to see it's certainly not my favorite one of the three but i still do like the design of it so let's move on and take a look at the tier 2 back attachment for the night fae Okay, so this is the tier 2 attachment for the Night Fae, and it's definitely one of my favorite ones. I just love the fact that there are two giant butterflies that are animated and look really cool and just spraying off this kind of white dust from them. It is such an improvement over the first one, and actually, to be honest, it's actually better than the third one, but we'll get into that. But yeah, it's really cool, matches really nicely with this specific armor and a lot of the Covenant armor for the Night Fae. But of course, I would imagine these will be able to be used with any sort of armor. Uh, but specifically, you can see that they are designed around that. Now, that being said, it does actually clip a little bit with the shoulders uh, of this armor and obviously some other armor because it is quite close to the back of the character. But such a cool design. There is actually four different colors for this one and the other ones as well. Uh, but the icons that show the back pieces actually use this color. So I... Not really sure how they're going to handle coloration. Hopefully you can choose between the colors because that would be quite a nice little customization option. But the tier 2 definitely being my favorite one for the Night Fae. Uh, those butterflies are just so goddamn good. And I just wish they kind of took off and flew around and landed back on the, uh, on the backpack there. But they don't as of right now. But still a very, very cool design. And finally, let's take a look at the tier 3 option for the Night Fae.
Okay, so this is essentially a backpack, kind of a nature-y backpack with little satchels and things hanging off of it. As of right now, there are no physics on the little dangly bits. I would imagine that's something that might come in a little bit later uh, to give this a little bit more excitement, I guess. Because essentially, as I said, the tier 2, in my opinion, is better than this tier 3. But again, we don't actually know if it will be a kind of upgrade system or it will just be a choice of 3. Uh, but personally, yeah, this kind of just looks like a backpack. I do like the coloration. As I said, it does match very, very nicely with the Night Fae armors. Certainly not my favorite, but definitely improvement over the tier one. And once again, there is four different color varieties for this backpack. So hopefully we do get a choice of those. So that's pretty much it, guys. That is the three back attachments for the Night Fae Covenant armor. Do let me know which one is your favorite. As I said, tier two is definitely the best for me, but you never know. You might like the tier three one as well, or even the tier two. So as I said, do let me know down below what your favorite one is. Also, let me know what Covenant you want to see next. All of the back attachments for the Covenant seem to be in the game right now, so we could take a look at any one that you like. So before I go, I'd like to give a massive shout out to my amazing patrons, YouTube channel members, and Twitch subs. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to support the channel in any of those ways, links are down below. So leave a like on this video, guys, if you liked it, and subscribe if you haven't. We've also got a partner Discord channel with over 3,000 members. And as I said, I am streaming on twitch.tv slash MrGM if you want to check me out streaming over on Twitch, streaming the Shadowlands Alpha, twitch.tv slash MrGM. And with that, guys, I'll see you next time.